What's going on guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, today I'm gonna be talking about something that I use in my t-shirt business that actually helps me out a lot. Um, I, I haven't been getting, you know, to put up a lot of videos. I've been having issues here, obviously, if you can see up here, I've been having uh, plumbing problems here. So this room has been getting reassembled, disassembled for them to come in and check it out and do what they gotta do. So that's why I haven't been uploading videos, but I'll get back on, you know, a weekly upload after everything's taken care of. So um, uh, one thing that's always, you know, uh, since I started doing t-shirts, I was always having a hard time in the beginning with uh, getting my, doing my packaging and things were taking too long and everything like that. So one simple thing that I invested in, it was only, I believe like 16 bucks. I'll leave the link for it in the description. And I'm sure a lot of people already seen this is a t-shirt folder. This is the Box Legend V3, I believe. I think it was 16 bucks. And I'm gonna show you guys how I use it, but this right here was a game changer for me in the beginning. Even when I have uh, people that order just say 10, 15 shirts and just to you know fold them up and get them packaged, I get the poly mailers. So I could basically, on here it doesn't give you, you know, the size of it, but for your basic size, it's sizes your mediums here, like basically extra large. This will make it so it'll fit right into a poly mailer. Your bigger sizes, yeah, you gotta you know finagle a little bit, but this right here from the beginning was a game changer for me because it was taking me so long to fold up shirts and things like that. So I'm gonna actually demonstrate this. I'm gonna show you actually my shirts that I keep stock here, um, how I fold them, and you know, basically you can see what this does. And um, a lot of people out there with t-shirt businesses probably use this. They probably use the automatic ones where they're, you know, they're uh, machine operated. But if you're just starting off only a couple years into it, or even like people at home doing laundry or whatever, this thing, I don't like folding clothes and this thing works perfect for me. So I'm going to show you my little setup I have here of my stock shirts, and then I'll show you how to use that. Okay. So over here is where I have my stock shirts. I keep your basic colors, obviously this pile right here, it's not done with that, but the rest of them are. And I did all these when I get them in. I keep uh, gray, white, black, and colors that I like. Obviously I have the olive green over there, but I did all that with the t-shirt folder. And um, so I'm gonna set up the t-shirt folder and show you guys how to use it. Okay, so hopefully I got the camera up so you all could see. So like I said, I used to do the regular folding and that was just becoming a pain in the ass. So I spent the, I believe like 16 bucks on this. So this right here is an extra large and you could make them any way you want. So I usually do it. I put the front of the shirt down, put this, the flip up on the bottom here. It gives you directions on here and I'll, I'll leave the link for this one. But this is like the larger shirts an extra large so usually with this i'll fold this up first and then i'll just hit it like that pull that in and then you flip it forward there you go and that's how exactly how i use this when i'm doing any orders and then i take it put it right into the poly mailer and it's good to go so like i'll show you with a smaller shirt let me see if I have any smaller or mediums here. I have a medium here. These ones work out a lot better with this, which I'm sure they make bigger ones. Even with this, I'd flip it up right here. And that's easily how you could use that. Same thing with uh, like the longer sleeve shirts. I don't think I have any of them to show, but the same thing is you just Fold the sleeves over. Like I said, put it up there. You don't even have to flip it up. I just choose to do that. Do it the way you want to do it. Go another one. So if you want it to look better, just pull that in. Flip it up. 
And these things are very cheap on Amazon. All right, guys, uh, I hope that was helpful. Like I said, just a quick video for the people out there just starting off, trying to get a t-shirt business going. I'll leave the link to, in the description for this. This is the Box Legend V3, I believe it is. I will leave the link. There's other ones out there. This is just the one that I chose. So, um, and also, like I said, I got things going on here with, uh, you know, plumbing issues and stuff like that. So I'm gonna try to post videos as much as I can. Um, right now I'm working in between plumbers to get, get this fixed. So I appreciate you know, everybody waiting. I appreciate all the support from everybody, but I will leave the link in the description for this. So if you would like, comment, subscribe, and I'm gonna keep coming out with some more of this t-shirt content and I'll catch you guys in the next one. All right, peace.